профессор Михаил, Михаил Сурначев, Лаврентий феномен and partial sobolus spaces of differential forms. Uh, so, uh, may I start? Uh, so, uh, um, what I'm going to talk about uh, is uh, kind of continuation of uh, our uh, work with uh, Lars Dinning and uh, Anna Bauch, and this is joint work with uh, uh, Anna Hripunova Bauch from Bielefeld University. Uh, so, I start from a rather classical uh, uh, theme and then uh, pass to more recent uh, advances. Uh, so the, uh, what is Lavrentiev uh, phenomenon, Lavrentiev, uh, or it is called Lavrentiev gap. So uh, consider an integral function also, there can be also dependence on the function itself. Uh, and uh, we can minimize over the natural energy space. So uh, say functions from W11 with uh, finite energy. Uh, or, we, uh, or we can also uh, infimize over smooth functions. Uh, and uh, in, uh, so that was cl uh, classical Panelli existence theory. Uh, and uh, Lavrentiev constructed example uh, when these two uh, uh, numbers, uh, so when we minimize over uh, natural energy space and over smooth functions, uh, these numbers are different. Uh, later, this example was uh, somehow simplified by Mania. Uh, so you, you see here that uh, this function just uh, turns, uh, so if you consider integral from zero to one, then it is just zero. And one can show that for, say, C1 functions uh, with these boundary values, uh, this is strictly greater than some fixed uh, positive number. So here I uh, uh, write the classical Tonelli theorem, existing theorem in, in the space of absolutely continuous functions, which uh, assume prescribed one boundary values. Uh, and uh, he, and uh, also Lavrentiev in, uh, in this paper, he also showed that, for example, if uh, uh, the integrand is independent of uh, the function itself, then there is no gap, or this cannot be generalized. Later, it was also generalized by Mania. Uh, so this, uh, this problem, it is uh, uh, closely re related to the um, uh, to density of smooth functions. So clearly, if uh, smooth functions are dense uh, in the corresponding energy space, then there is no gap. There can be no gap. For classical Sobolev spaces, uh, these are quite uh, old results. So uh, for, uh, for, uh, for domains with some assumptions on smoothness, uh, this uh, was known before. And for general domains, this was proved by Mertz and Serian. The, uh, the paper was called just A H equals W. Uh, and uh, the tool is just um, Friedrich's mollifier, and uh, basically that's it. Uh, this also works for uh, convex integrants uh, of this type, and also can be generalized uh, to some dependence on uh, the function. Uh, then uh, now more. Uh, uh, of, uh, more advanced objects. Uh, one can uh, also consider sobley for rich spaces, uh, uh, which are uh, which have energy corresponding to this uh, or, or rich function capital Phi, uh, and uh, pose the same question. Uh, whether uh, the closure of smooth functions in this space uh, co uh, co uh, coincides with the, uh, with the space itself. Uh, for, uh, uh, in, in the case when uh, this phenomenon is absent, when there is no gap and smooth functions are dense, H equals W, 
variational problems were uh, were studied even in this general setting by quite a number of authors, uh, some old books and uh, and recent um, Italian school, uh, of course, then Germans and so on. Uh, uh, then uh, uh, there was uh, in uh, 1890, in uh, 1996, uh, Zhikov constructed uh, his famous uh, example for uh, Lagrangian gap in the case of uh, functional of this form. Uh, so uh, he found. Uh, exponent p uh, vector field b actually the solenoidal vector field such that uh, these two numbers are different uh, the exponent looks uh, like this so his example is uh, in uh, in a disk but uh, for our purposes it will be more convenient to use these uh, square blocks uh, so it is, so it is greater than two in this part and uh, less than two in this part. Uh, so this is kind of subtle point for the exponent and, uh, and uh, in, this, uh, in his example, the exponent crosses uh, dimension, so-called dimension threshold. Uh, uh, so for uh, say for density, uh, one can look at uh, function uh, constructed like this, it is constant here and minus this constant here, and they're connected by some, say, this is linear or smooth transition. Uh, and uh, it is from the from W, but uh, cannot cannot be approximated by smooth functions. Why? Uh, here it is uh, in these parts. It is uh, Gilder continuous, so. It, so it has trace from the, from above and from below. Uh, for uh, for this function, these traces are obviously different. Uh, but for any smooth function, they they obviously coincide. So it cannot be obtained as uh, as a limit of smooth functions. Uh, and uh, also using this uh, this function, he uh, gave an example of uh, Lagrangian gap for this function. Uh, so this is uh, this method based on um, kind of, so we build separating functional of this form, which is zero on smooth functions, but uh, not zero on U in W. Uh, then uh, the second method is to build separating functional e in this integral form. Uh, so it was in this Zhikov's paper in 86. Uh, and actually, we, we, uh, we developed this method. Uh, so another model quite popular uh, is uh, so-called double phase potential. Uh, so this, uh, this is a variable exponent. Uh, also, one can study similar um, Problems with the uh, double phase potential and uh, similar difficulties arise. Uh, for this case, um, also uh, the uh, Zhikov's example was uh, re was refined in this paper. Um, and uh, but uh, all these examples they uh, they require that uh, the exponents uh, be be separated by the, the dimension mm. and uh, and uh, two three years ago we uh, we found a general procedure for uh, for constructing examples of this kind mm. so it uses uh, basically uh, this uh, idea with the integral separating functional uh, so find uh, you from uh, the natural energy space and this uh, vector field uh, b from the conjugate space 
Uh, so this uh, gives you a bounded linear functional, uh, which is uh, uh, you can construct such uh, one can construct such u and b that uh, this functional is zero on smooth functions and not zero on uh, this function u on the special function u. So this gives uh, absence of density, non-density, Lavrentiev gap, and so on. Mm. Uh, in uh, 2D, uh, this, uh, this uh, special vector field is constructed as, uh, as glad probe of some function. Uh, and um, so this kind of some insight for more, for, for higher dimensions. If you look at this object, the, uh, this is just, uh, this can be, uh, though this, for, this function smooth, this would be just area form. Uh, so, uh, so these uh, this, uh, this functions, in a sense, they give counterexample to um, um, not uh, not uh, not counterexample, but uh, but for these functions, standard integration by parts, of course, by parts, of course, um, breaks because they are not sufficiently smooth. Uh, uh, so uh, here is uh, some modification of standard Jacobs building block. And uh, here uh, there is contact set, uh, which has, uh, in this case, it had the dimension zero. And the idea is to increase the, the dimension of this contact set. So, uh, so takes, uh, so to um, uh, find uh, example, to build an example with contact set of, of, of intermediate uh, dimensions between zero and one. Like, uh, for example, one can take Counter sets. Uh, this is quite classical in uh, analysis, of course. Uh, so this is how it is generated. Uh, the function u looks like this, and uh, uh, so there are these uh, uh, beads, diamonds uh, of uh, the counter necklace. Again, uh, rather classical object. Uh, used before mm. and this is how this function looks like and uh, by direct calculation one can uh, evaluate its uh, integrability and the second function v which uh, which which provides uh, this vector field for separating functional it uh, it looks like this o o on this line the, uh, the, this is just the uh, counter staircase and uh, as you go to this line, it becomes closer and closer to this limit counter step function. Again, uh, one can uh, mm, evaluate uh, its uh, integrability uh, directly in this simple case. Uh, so in, uh, in in 3D, uh, this, uh, this separating vector field is constructed as rotor of something, and for higher dimensions, uh, the language changes, so, so one can use differential forms or uh, skew symmetric um, or divergence of skew symmetric matrices. Uh, so this is how kind of uh, function U can be constructed in 3D. Uh, and uh, now I, I compare it to the, to the previously known example uh, by Francesc Mal and Mingioni. So they, they, st uh, they studied double face model, but with this dimensional threshold, and uh, they, sh um, they showed existence of minimizers with the singular, singular set of uh, Hausdorff dimensional arbitrarily close to n minus p. Uh, and uh, this is based on infinitely adding up Zhikov's uh, blocks for finer and finer scales, but uh, this uh, basically gives uh, the, uh, the same function as uh, we have, they did not consider directly uh, problem of density or gap, but uh, implicitly it is here. So one can derive it from here also. Uh, but uh, they had this uh, dimensional th uh, th threshold because they uh, used uh, energy estimates uh, uh, based on pointwise traces from above and from below. And of course, for this, you need to have P greater than dimension, exponent greater than dimension. So, branching problems for uh, differential forms. 
uh, uh, so for the time being, we, we, we work with, uh, I think it can, it can be called uh, the, only, the only index structure, uh, because uh, here we have the dependence only on the modulus of uh, the exterior derivative. Uh, and uh, here phi is uh, an orange function, so just orange function uh, uh, with uh, this uh, general growth condition. Uh, and B is also a form. So this is a kind of generalization of the previous setting. Uh, in the previous setting, uh, we work with uh, mm, so function, this is just zero form, okay? Uh, then, uh, so here I recall some basic definitions. Mm, so uh, we have very limited knowledge of geometry. We uh, work only with the uh, standard Euclidean settings. So no uh, tangent bundles, uh, no matrix, uh, so just Delta IJ and so on, just RM, simplest case. Uh, so this Hodge duality exterior uh, differential forms. Uh, so here in this simple setting, we just uh, work with the expressions of this kind. Uh, exterior derivative, uh, co-differential and component the, uh, they're given by these formulas. Of course, in 3D, they, they correspond to classical operators of uh, uh, vector uh, calculus. Mm. So, uh, and uh, one can also uh, pose the same problem. Mm. Uh, we can minimize over all forms from natural energy space of all forms uh, for which this is finite or over, okay, this is rather inf, uh, or over smooth forms. Uh, and uh, the same problem for density of smooth, in this case, forms in uh, so-called, uh, so, oh, sorry, I think I give this definition of partial sublet spaces uh, later, but it will slightly later. So some, uh, some classical references, uh, classical uh, theory of uh, uh, forms uh, was studied by Hodge, uh, Weil, Deram, Kadaira, Gaffney, Duff, Spencer, Mori. Friedrichs, uh, then there were, of course, a number of uh, later works, uh, especially uh, these are interesting uh, as, uh, as application to calculus of variations. And uh, 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 clear, uh, so in classics, everything was linear, and, uh, and later uh, people uh, developed nonlinear. Uh, analogs of um, Hodge theory, uh, studied par uh, partial regularity. Uh, so this is quite active field. Um, uh, so what is uh, the difference uh, with the kind of standard functional setting? Uh, for forms, you, you can work with the so-called full Sobolev Orlich space, um, which is uh, which means that all that uh, all components of uh, the differential forms form are in uh, the corresponding Sobolev orange space, or you can work with uh, partial, uh, more general object and in some sense more natural object for these problems, partial Sobolev orange space. There you can, uh, there you have only differential or co-differential from the corresponding or Lichlebeck space. Uh, so these are standard green formulas for forms. Mm, and uh, 
So this, uh, this leads to also rather standard definitions so of forms with vanishing normal or tangential components. Uh, this is also kind of uh, generalization from uh, standard uh, identities of uh, 3D vector calculus. Uh, some existing theorem for systems of uh, Cauchy Riemann type that we use. Mm. And uh, here, uh, so one can uh, prove two kind of uh, existence results for variational problems. So this is when we minimize in the large Sobolev space. Uh, and, uh, and the second problem when we minimize in this space H, which is obtained as closure of, uh, by, by, um, by the closure of smooth forms. Uh, here you can also prove, here we, we can also prove uh, an existence result. Uh, but clearly, uh, nobody uh, can guarantee that in the general case, then these two minimizers are the same. Uh, so uh, now let me finally um, pass to our uh, to general to generalization of our example for differential forms. So how it is constructed? So what replaces uh, Zhikov's basic blocks in the case of forms? Uh, we take, uh, so this is just fundamental solution of the Laplace equation. Uh, and uh, we write this um, expression. So what is the meaning of this? Uh, so this uh, means just uh, you can consider it as an say end of form, right? So just uh, so the, the form which uh, measures uh, area, say, on the sphere, nor uh, normalized area, uh, and uh, this function theta. So. Uh, uh, and this function theta, it makes some cut so that, uh, the, so, so that the result is singular um, everywhere outside the origin. So here I, uh, I write for, for simplicity these uh, infinity norms. Uh, this is uh, uh, simpler for, uh, I think, for initial perception. Uh, because uh, later we work with uh, cubic geometry uh, more convenient, but, uh, but it can also be, be replaced by the standard Euclidean norm, so there is no problem in this. Mm. Uh, so what is uh, the basic property of these two forms? Uh, first, this relation. So their, uh, their differentials are supported on different sets, uh, uh, which intersect only, which can intersect only at the origin. Uh, and uh, then uh, second, this property. Mm, so basically, this means that, uh, of course, we these forms do not satisfy the uh, the standard assumptions uh, of the Stokes theorem, and uh, it means that, uh, um, of course, for these two forms, the Stokes theorem is not valid because uh, the if you take formal differential of this expression, this will give d a 
um, times du, and uh, this is zero, but uh, the integral over the boundary is not zero. Uh, but uh, since uh, these two forms uh, are regular outside the origin, we can also uh, replace here the boundary of the cube by uh, uh, the boundary of any uh, balls containing the origin. Uh, so outside the origin, the Stokes theorem works for, for this pair. Uh, one can, uh, so here are some estimates for integrability properties. They belong actually to the standard Sobolev space W11. Uh, all the uh, components belong to and how then singular sets are constructed. Uh, we work with a slight generalization of the standard uh, counter set. So here we uh, add a additional um, term. So for, for the standard counter set, the, the lengths of this uh, of counter intervals are uh, some lambda to the power j where lambda is uh, from zero to one half. And here we uh, add an additional parameter, which, uh, which allows uh, us some fine tuning. Uh, so here are uh, kind of, and uh, then uh, our singular set, our uh, contact set we, uh, will be just a direct product of K copies of this one dimensional counter set. Uh, and we also need this uh, thing, counter sets. Uh, forms are built this way. So this uh, kind of direct generalization of the, of the example for forms. Uh, they have required properties. Uh, then let me skip this. So they satisfy this, this, uh, here we, we work uh, with double phase potential and uh, one can construct A from uh, with these models of continuity and forms U, U and A with these integrability properties uh, satisfying this uh, regular outside the singular set uh, sigma and uh, based on, on these forms we construct uh, the separating functional sets before. Uh, which uh, separates uh, smooth functions in this whole space. Uh, so here are admissible ranges of, uh, of parameters and here is con conclusion. So thank you for your attention. And I think that's- Thank you. Questions, please. Uh, Mm -hmm. uh, am I right that uh, you, in a sense, uh, shift uh, this dimension gap, uh, that uh, dimension uh, uh, obstacle, yeah? mm -hmm. uh, instead of uh, n, mm -hmm. you have n minus the dimension of how mm -hmm. dimension of uh, the singular set. Yes, yes, yes. But then uh, using the duality, one can also obtain for uh, greater than dimension. Okay. More questions, please. Mikhail, what is right? Sobolev Orlich space or Orlich Sobolev space? Uh, <laughs> I, I see two versions here. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Let us thank once again. Some references and.